Instagram channel. Got an early video for NHL for tomorrow, Saturday, February 17. Quick recap of Flex Friday. Luckily, it was Flex Friday. My slip did not hit. Uh, but luckily, it was Flex Friday, so it was a free roll. It's going to be hard for the next couple of days, I believe, till Thursday when NBA is back. Uh, but so far, we just have uh, LOL, Esports, CS2, Hockey, and the All-Star game. Uh, but it's pretty tough to find some pretty good value or some decent props uh, without NBA, NFL, or MLB at the moment. Uh, but as you can see, I got Daily Grind Fantasy. That is my main two. As you can see, there is a lot of green for uh, esports. Uh, usually, it's uh, pretty green uh, the night prior. As you can see, some of these props are not posted on other sites, uh, but they're pretty inflated on other sites. Right now, you can get some pretty good value on esports, on price picks. Uh, I'm not too familiar with esports to be honest. Usually, I use Daily Grind Fantasy. So as you can see, I did numerous uh, numerous slips among these top ten right here with all green. Uh, anything above 51, 52 percent is usually good. Usually, it's already color coded here for you. Um, but yeah, let's go straight to hockey. As this video will be covering NHL. Um, as you can see, there's good value for esports right now. So you may want to take a look if you guys are familiar with that or if you guys follow that. For NHL, my top picks right now that I got is John Tavares. And that is brings me to my first leg of this five man I have built up. It has nearly a 55% hit rate to go over. Uh, I checked the stats and it's Five pass matchup against the Ducks. He has gone well over four shots on goal. I mean, worst case scenario, he pushes, uh, but I think he's gonna have five goals or more against the Ducks. Ducks are not playing very good hockey right now, uh, so I got John Tavares going over with the help of Daily Grind Fantasy. My second leg I'm going with is Tory Krug, and he has a 53.8 percent to go over. He got two shots or over on Nashville uh, worst case worst case scenario also he pushes um, but I think he's gonna have about three or four in this matchup my third leg I am going with is Cody Glass and I feel pretty confident about this one I like this prop at two I think this might get bumped to 2.5 his production has been uh, much better of late so I'm gonna be taking the over on him my next two will be unders and this one is the third option on daily grind fantasy to go under on points and that is tom wilson so i'll be taking the under on that i don't think he's gone over in this past eight matchups straight uh, so i'll be taking the under on that and my last one will be james vaughn and i'll be taking the under on the shots on go on him uh, there's too many shooters for the bruins uh, the Kings have been playing pretty well right now, uh, so I don't think it's going to be a blow. So I don't think he's going to have that many chances to have shots on goal. So I'll be taking the under on James Band. So those are the five I'm going with. Obviously, four of these five, Daily Grind Fantasy has a 53.8% or higher to go over. Bet lightly. I know NBA is not here right now. Uh, no NFL. Uh, MLB is right around the corner. Uh, so it's tough to make some slips right now with limited props and limited sport, sports going on. Uh, but these are the five best I can come up with. Bet lightly. Uh, so I got John Tavares and Tory Krug over shots on goal. Same with Cody Glass. Tom Wilson under points. And James Van under shots on goal. Uh, my favorites would probably be John Tavares and Cody Glass if you try to do a two-man. Uh, but as of right now, I just start to stick to three mans or five mans and just stick to five dollars. But good luck. Mix and match. Pick your favorite. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Appreciate the support. And I'll see you guys in the next one.